Whether you're looking to relax on the beach, explore the island's rich history and culture, or indulge in adventure sports, the Caribbean island paradise of Jamaica has something for everyone. Here are the best things to do and places to visit in Jamaica. Number 14. Blue and John Crow Mountains National Park The Blue and John Crow Mountains National Park in Jamaica is a true natural and cultural treasure. Inscribed as a UNESCO World Heritage Site in 2015, this park offers a wealth of breathtaking scenery, from jungle-clad mountains and waterfalls to lush rainforests and coffee plantations. The park is also home to an impressive array of wildlife, including over 800 species of endemic plants, 200 species of birds, and even the world's second largest butterfly. A highlight of a visit to the park is hiking or taking a mule ride up to the summit of Jamaica's highest peak, Blue Mountain Peak. At 7,400 feet high, the summit offers thrilling views, including a glimpse of neighboring Cuba on a clear day. Number 13. Negril Negril is a town located in western Jamaica that is home to one of the Caribbean's most beautiful stretches of white sand and crystal clear water, Negril Beach. Dubbed as the Seven Mile Beach, but actually closer to four miles long, the beach extends from Bloody Bay to Long Bay and is backed by the famous Negril Cliffs. The beach is lined with a variety of resorts, from large, all-inclusive properties to smaller boutique hotels, and offers a wide range of water sports, including snorkeling, kayaking, and diving. The Negril Cliffs, rising above the clear blue waters, is the perfect spot to watch the sunset, and for those looking for an adrenaline rush, can consider jumping off the cliffs for fun. Number 12. Dunn's River Falls Dunn's River Falls, located in Ocho Rios, is a natural wonder that stands at 180 feet tall and 600 feet long. You can climb up the limestone edges of the waterfall as the cool water provides a refreshing contrast to the typical heat of Jamaica. The water cascades into the sea at Little Dunn's River Beach, making it one of the few Traverton waterfalls in the world. The falls are one of the most popular tourist attractions in Jamaica, and with its Instagram-worthy terraced waterfalls, it's no wonder millions of tourists hike 90 minutes to see it every year. It's also immortalized on the Jamaican $100 bill. Number 11. Reach Falls if you prefer a less touristy waterfall, then this is for you. Reach Falls, located near Port Antonio, is a hidden gem among the island's many waterfalls. Tucked away in the montane forest of the John Crow Mountain Range, visitors can take a gentle hike through the tropical rainforest to reach the falls. The falls themselves flow gently and quietly, cascading down to the underwater caves. You can stand under the streaming cascades, explore the caves, and swim in the fern-fringed waters surrounded by rainforest. With more than 20 different species of ferns growing in this area, and a variety of birds, including yellow-billed parrots, it's a great spot for nature lovers. Number 10. Doctor's Cave Beach Doctor's Cave Beach in Montego Bay is a popular strip of white sand fringed by clear waters. The beach got its name in the early 1920s when a British osteopath claimed that the water had curative powers after swimming there. This claim helped shape the fate of Montego Bay as a tourist destination, as hotels sprouted up and the area became a thriving tourist destination. Even though the namesake cave was destroyed by a hurricane in 1932, the beach is still as popular as ever and is considered one of the top things to do in Montego Bay. Number 9. Martha Bray River Rafting on the Martha Bray River in Jamaica is a popular activity, especially for couples. The Martha Bray River's village offers bamboo raft trips pulled by local guides. You can glide down the picturesque stretch of river enjoying the tropical scenery and stop at local vendors along the way to purchase souvenirs or refreshments. The guides entertain visitors during the trip, singing reggae songs or sharing interesting information about the flora and fauna. It's also a great place for a romantic day out. With the chance to listen to local tales and legends, sip on cold drinks, and stroll through Miss Martha's Herb Garden. Number 8. Black River Tour The longest river in Jamaica, the Black River, is fringed with mangroves and home to over 100 species of birds, including herons and snowy egrets, as well as crocodiles. A guided boat tour is the perfect way to explore this tranquil river and learn about the area's ecology and history. The tour is often combined with a visit to the beautiful YS Falls. Jamaica's largest cascades, with seven waterfalls, natural pools, and activities like zip lining, rope swinging, and river tubing, the YS Falls offers something for everyone, perfect for a hot day. The YS Falls are also suitable for children, 
By the way, if you want to learn how to save money on airfares, then click the link in the description below. This guide teaches you how to always get the cheapest flights. Number 7. Blue Hole The Blue Hole, also known as the Blue Lagoon, is a series of picturesque water holes located in the rainforest cloaked mountains outside Ocho Rios. It is fed by gushing cascades, and guides can lead you around the area where you can explore the falls and jump off cliffs into the refreshing pools below. The higher up the falls you climb, the less people you will probably encounter, but the trail can be tricky to navigate. The water color of the blue hole changes depending on how the sun hits the water and can be seen in sapphire, royal blue, or turquoise color. It is also known for its unique natural phenomenon as it is formed by the mixture of fresh water from mineral springs and salt water from the Caribbean Sea. Number 6. Falmouth Falmouth is a picturesque town located on the northern shore of Jamaica, known for its well-preserved Georgian architecture. The town was once a leading port in the Caribbean, and it still offers excellent examples of 19th century Georgian architecture, including a restored courthouse. Visitors can explore the Greenwood Great House, a museum with period furniture and a rare collection of musical instruments and Wedgwood China. Other popular activities in Falmouth include visiting the Good Hope Plantation, an old established coconut and sugar plantation, basking on Red Stripe and Burwood Beach, and taking a trip to the Luminous Lagoon, named for its marine phosphorescence. There is also a heritage walk to discover the history of the town, especially the slave trade hubs. Number 5. Port Antonio Port Antonio is a charming and peaceful fishing village on the northeastern coast of Jamaica. Known for its quiet atmosphere, it's the perfect spot for visitors looking to escape the hustle and bustle of more crowded tourist destinations. The village itself is a mix of colorful markets, Georgian and Victorian architecture, and cozy cafes. But it's the incredible natural surroundings that really make Port Antonio special. Visitors can explore the area's sensational jungles, crystal clear waterfalls, turquoise lagoons, beautiful beaches, and epic hiking trails. Other popular activities include rafting the Rio Grande, diving and snorkeling the coral reefs, and swimming in the Blue Lagoon, which is said to be 200 feet deep and was featured in the movie of the same name. Number 4. Rose Hall Great House Rose Hall Great House is a must-see destination in Jamaica. Built in 1770, the restored plantation house offers breathtaking ocean views and a glimpse into the past with its period furniture. But the real draw of Rose Hall is its eerie history. Legend has it that the notorious Annie Palmer, known as the White Witch, ruled the house with cruelty and met a violent death. Visitors can choose from a daytime tour to learn about the history of the house or a spooky evening tour by candlelight to hear tales of ghost sightings and possibly even spot the White Witch herself. Number 3. Rainforest Adventures Mystic Mountain Rainforest Adventures Mystic Mountain in Ocho Rios is an adrenaline junkie's paradise. Get your heart racing on the Bobsled Jamaica, a single-person roller coaster ride that speeds through the forest. For a more leisurely experience, glide through the treetops on the zip lines or take the Sky Explorer, a chairlift that ascends the mountain, offering panoramic views of the town and sea. But it's not all thrills and spills. Nature lovers can also enjoy guided walks, butterfly and hummingbird gardens, a ropes course, an infinity pool and water slide, and a climbing wall. Number 2. Bob Marley Museum if you're a fan of Bob Marley, the Bob Marley Museum in Kingston is a must-see destination on your vacation in Jamaica. The museum is located in the former home and studio of the legendary reggae artist, who purchased the property on 56 Hope Road in 1975 and lived there until his death in 1981. Visitors can explore the beautifully hand-painted murals and statue of Bob, view his personal treasures such as platinum and gold records and awards, and take a tour of his old room which has been left untouched since the day he left it. The museum also features a stunning photo gallery and offers a one-hour tour. It is one of the best places to visit in Jamaica while on vacation. Number 1. Kingston Kingston, Jamaica's bustling capital city, is a melting pot of culture and history. Located at the foot of the Blue Mountains, it offers a cosmopolitan contrast to the island's laid-back vibe. While the city can be gritty and rough around the edges, there's plenty to see and do for visitors. Besides the above-mentioned Bob Marley Museum, reggae fans can also visit the Trenchtown Culture Yard Museum, where reggae music was born. Visitors can also check out historic mansions like Devon House and museums, such as the National Gallery and the Natural History Museum. Emancipation Park is a popular spot for music concerts and National Heroes Park features statues of leading players in Jamaican history and independence. 
Click here for more places to visit in the Caribbean.